So the biggest thing I have, and even like well-rounded models sometimes just don't do this, is so whenever I whenever we're shooting, I will kind of set you up and start off with like a pose. But when you um like after I shoot, you should when you hear that, or if we're using flash, once you see the flash hit, you should change pose. So so many models will stand there and they'll be like. And then I'll be shooting and they'll be like, and I'm just like, okay, we don't want the same photo 50 times because I just, when it slows stuff down, like I've worked with people and we've gotten like super good shots in like five minutes. And then I've worked with people where I'm shooting like constantly and then they've done this and then maybe they've like changed or they'll like open their mouth. So every time you hear the shutters click, unless I like, I'm like, okay, hold on you guys, like, or hold on. Um, let's make sure we get this look because this is looking super good, but something was off maybe On a rare occasion I'll miss autofocus and I'll just be like, oh, well, it's not gonna look good So like let's try to redo that which is never a good situation, but sometimes it has to be done or I'll be like um, Okay, so I really like that pose But like let's try to have more eye contact with the camera or chin up chin down uh, Let's fix your hair hair sometimes gets messed up and I can edit it in post, but it's better to get it in camera so the big thing is, unless I say something to stop that, is you don't just stand there and like do the same stance the whole time. <laughs> so, and then the, actually the opposite can be said too, is if I'm shooting and then you hear the click, like you're not doing a pose, you're just like constantly like flailing your arms around. I see people do that kind of frequently and it's just not, um, that's not helpful either because it's, because then I'm going to get photos of you like this this and stuff so when composing a photo I'll have you set up how I want you like maybe it'll be like a straight up stance which is probably not what it'll be but if it were um, and then I will take photo and then I don't want you to stay there I want you to move for the next shutter and I want that pose to be the next one and then after that I want you to change it slightly it doesn't have to be crazy you don't have to be doing like all these random things every time I do it, but like changing your facial expression, uh, maybe moving hair slightly, that'll like give the best result and it'll help the photos to move. Like there'll be a little bit of a narrative with it. It won't just be like, okay, so we got one photo even though I've taken, you know, 200 shots of you. That's just not.